Welcome back, NYP Entertainment Radio. Kyle and Alonzo, um, thank you for joining us. As you can see, we have our first guest here. Now, you probably recognize him because he was he called in over the summer, I believe. Yeah, that was um, um, yeah, a couple a few of months, months ago. A couple of months ago, um, this gentleman called in. This is author Paul D. Jones of the new book. Make sure to show everybody. Schedule for success. Schedule for success. We got him here in the flesh because he called in, and we, we really enjoyed um, the interview with you, um, the call in, so I'm, going, I'm very, very happy that you're here in the studio live. I'm happy to be here. Make sure the mic is on. Sorry about that. Go ahead. We good? We good? All right. We good. We good. I'm happy to be here. I mean, y'all <laughs> doing an extraordinary thing, and I'm just saying, hey, you know, I'm happy to be a part of it because this is, this is history right now. <laughs> <laughs> hey, we appreciate that. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. But it's not about us, it's about you. It's about me right now. Well, well, we appreciate the love. I'm just happy to be in y'all's presence. All, you know, I'm, it's, it's major. I was just telling Alonzo that where you're back in Minnesota, where we're from, and Wisconsin, Illinois, and mm -hmm. Iowa, you know, you tell somebody you're in the Bronx and you're on there, that, that's value. Mm -hmm. So a lot of times people don't realize that you may think you're doing something small, but you're actually doing something huge. Mm -hmm. right. Because around the world, you know, you're famous. Mm -hmm. You know, you may be humbled by it, but it's like you was right. famous. So I'm, mm -hmm. I'm happy to be in y'all's presence and, and appreciate the good work that y'all are doing also. Well, thank you for me. Thank you. Appreciate that. Um, now, Explain schedule for success. Turn your schedule into stepping stones for success. Explain, because I, I, I want to hear it, because we're, we're, we're both trying to, you know, right. get to that next level, as, as we were telling you off the air. And, uh, you know, a lot of things you said a couple of months ago were very poignant, and like I said, I'm so happy that you're here. Yeah. We can extend on this a little bit, you know, um, in terms of the schedule for your success and the steps towards uh, success. Well, one of the main things is having a vision, and that's what you guys have established already, mm. is having a vision because without that vision, people perish. They don't really get where they want it to be. And then you look at it and say, okay, your life becomes a treasure map. Mm. Right. Because what you're doing is you're saying, you know what, I'm going to document my steps. Mm -hmm. You know, we, when we were kids, they played them dot-to-dot -dot games. Mm -hmm. You know, and if you really think about it, once you filled in all the dots, you mm -hmm. had the full picture. Mm -hmm. Right. So right. what we're saying is you got the full picture, the, the invisible image, but it's the self-image of where you'd like to be in the future. Mm -hmm. Now you're coming back and you're saying, you know what, now I'm putting these stones to, together, these stepping stones together mm -hmm. to make sure that I arrive at the life that I desire right. mm -hmm. versus the life because when people end up in certain places, they got to realize that all, all that happened is they got pushed by somebody else yes. who had a schedule. Yes. Mm -hmm. So we must be mindful that when you don't schedule, you're still scheduling yourself to be a part of somebody else's schedule. Mm -hmm. So that's why it's important that everyone has a daily schedule. When you wake up in the morning, don't just wake up slow like, ah, oh, what am I going to do today? You already behind. Yes. Mm -hmm. yes. You have to wake up with a mission every day because business does not stop. Business mm -hmm. does not sleep. I agree. And, and your heart doesn't stop. Mm -hmm. Your heart is business. Right. Mm -hmm. So you got to put your heart in it. And if you realize that, you know, you may be saying you're tired and this and that, but as long as that heart is beating, you better have a plan of what you're going to put your heart into right. it's building the, the goal. next day. That's right. So right. once that goal is in place, now we say, okay, establish that plan. Mm -hmm. Go for it. You're going to have negative people. Mm -hmm. It's inevitable. You're going to have some things that not go right. That's inevitable. You know, and, and a lot of times people make a mistake of saying, you know what, I'm in business, but, you know, this is what happens. So in the book Schedule for Success, I talk about a, in, in the book how much did that excuse cost you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Because sometimes we say, well, you know what, I was going to do this, but I didn't have all the money. You know, one of the things I want to get everybody to be mindful of, never make your plans build built around the money you have now. Mm -hmm. You'll never ask. <coughs> you right, know, because you ne right. you'll never have enough money day one. Mm -hmm. But if you build your plan and you get excited about your plan, somebody else has some money. Yes. Mm -hmm. And somebody else is going to get excited and be like, yo, Kyle, Alonzo, y'all got a great idea. Mm -hmm. You know, you know what? I got a friend who has a friend because also in the book Schedule for Success, it talks about something that's in there called the four keys to your connection kit. Mm -hmm. Well, one of those is good people. Because mm -hmm. good people also know someone else who is good who will refer someone. Yeah. So this yeah. world is smaller now, especially in one of the other keys in the connection kit that's in this book, Schedule for Success, mm -hmm. is technology. Mm -hmm. Because of technology, today we're broadcasting you know, across the world. Mm -hmm. See, normally if this was 10, 15 years ago, I would be in the South Bronx with you or the Bronx with you, excuse mm -hmm. me. But... We would only be broadcasting in this particular area. Mm -hmm. right. So now if we realize that how technology is going to keep going, 
So if you have an idea why you got to act on it, because somebody might say, man, I, I want a syndicated show. You know, it would be great to be what we said back in the day, via satellite. Right. right. But now via satellite is like, it's just the Internet. Right, right. <laughs> you know? So yeah. you're there. So all it is is y'all got connected. You did what you had to do. There are many people out there who can hear our voices right now who they're sitting there like, you know what, I've always wanted to start this. I don't care if it's an auto detail shop or a barber shop or a clothing line or whatever it is you may want to do. You just go and make it visual, though. You got to write it down and make it clear. And then from there is, as long as your heart's in it, your passion's in it, your daily schedule will have something on it every day. So you may have a nine to five job, but when you get off, what are you going to do from five to nine? Mm -hmm. So, so many people form their life around nine to five and say, well, you know what? I put in a good day's work. And that's it. But I get people to understand this right here. Mm -hmm. You know, it's 24 hours in mm -hmm. a day. It's seven days in a week. Mm -hmm. If you multiply that out, you got 168. Now, people may be saying, now, why is he telling us the obvious? Because with most people and how they fall behind right here, if you get this, people will stay on their grind with a more keen sense of what's going on. We all spend money 24 hours a day, seven days a week, 168 hours mm -hmm. a week. We are spending money. Right. So that means every second of a minute, you're spending money. Every minute of an hour, you're spending money. Mm -hmm. And every hour of the day, you are spending money. And because it's out of sight, it's out of your mind. Mm -hmm. So we have to turn the tables in our favor and say, you know what, then if I'm spending money every second, every minute, every hour, then I also must have something working in my favor that allows me to make money the mm -hmm. same way because that's what offsets us. So if we understand what happened, why credit card companies and banks are so well, right. they said, well, you know what, <clears throat> you need to leverage yourself, don't you? So I'm going right, to give you this right. here credit card. And I'm going to let you go ahead and spend more money 24 hours a day. Then right. I'm going to sit down and I'm going to say, all right, you just pay it monthly. Pay $20, $30 a month. But you're paying interest, interest every second, yes. every minute, mm -hmm. every yes. hour. Mm -hmm. So therefore, now time goes on. You got into more debt. And you say, man, I can't, I can't get out of this situation. Right. Mm -hmm. So what we're saying to everyone, you just once you get mindful of it, start taking little chunks at it now. Mm -hmm. So in the book Schedule for Success, it really talks to people about starting new right now while they have the main things that they're going on because you can't just go quit your day job now, mm -hmm. but you can put 10 minutes, 15 minutes, 20 minutes into your new vision. Right. And over time, that time adds up. And before you know it, people are going to look at it like, man, it just seemed like just a year ago, two years ago, you were starting this. But three years later, you were on top. Mm -hmm. So we just encourage people <coughs> to schedule for success and get the book so that they can understand more and all the spiritual values behind it. Right. How would you um, tell someone to, how to handle setbacks? Because once people get not just one but a few setbacks, some people uh, throw their hands in the air and like, forget it because I'm mm -hmm. keep going back or they feel as though they're spinning their wheels in the mud, so to speak. Yep. Um, how would you tell them how to handle that? Thank Number you. one, handling something is understanding it, first right. of mm -hmm. all. Uh, setbacks are going to come, mm -hmm. period. I get them. I don't care what business you have, what dealing you're doing, I don't care if you're an athlete and you're just working mm -hmm. to, to your body to be able to play better, mm -hmm. you're going to have setbacks. You're yeah. going to pull a muscle. Yeah. It happens. We have it. H however, <laughs> right, right. <laughs> however, once you have your plan written down, you know, and I talk about in the book, Schedule for Success, how you block time out for the unexpected. Mm. See, everything you're doing, you're also building some reserves because, you know, think about it. I worked in the music industry years ago. And when a person did a recording contract, when they wanted their re royalties, the, the, the distributor held back reserves. And that was for records that were coming back unsold. Right, right. Well, same, likewise, it's like, okay, you have to reserve some time for these certain situations that's going to happen. Mm -hmm. And then do not, do not, do not get over emotional about it. You know, have patience. Because those who don't have patience are guaranteed to lose. Mm -hmm. Gotcha. You keep your patience intact, control your emotions, look at certain things when they happen. Then you say, you know what? This happened. Let me make my adjustment and let me keep on going because mistakes will happen. It's inevitable. That's a part of life and a part of business. Right. I mean, you mentioned having good people around you. Yes. You know, we all know that it's hard in this industry to find good yep. people to be around you. Yep. I mean, how do you go about, you know, deciphering, you know, who's good and who's not? You know, in, in times of dealing with good people, number one, I always say you have to be good. 
you know. Right. And then when you're good, you have to pay attention. I have a six-year-old son, and there's three things I teach him. And I say, listen, never tell a lie, and play hard. What I'm really doing, because he don't understand integrity yet. Mm-hmm. So if I just teach him at a young age, just don't lie, mm-hmm. you know. But I teach him, say, hey, son, if you keep this formula in life, and I like even on the phone with him this morning, mm-hmm. I made him say, hey, like, hey, man, what's the three things you got to stick to? And he's like, listen, don't tell a lie, and play hard. Play hard is have fun. Mm-hmm. Go at it. If you get caught on to do something, do it with all your might, even if you're not getting paid for it. Right, mm-hmm. right. So many share some certain information with them. You know, and mm-hmm. it's almost like you just leaking some information like the politicians do, mm-hmm. you know, and they do that to find out who's the leak in the campaign. Right. So they'll make mm-hmm. up something. I'm telling you to make up nothing. But mm-hmm. I'm saying how the political world works. Mm-hmm. They'll make something up to see who the leak is. And then they know that you're the only person I told that to. Mm-hmm. So therefore, I can't work with you. Mm-hmm. So having good people, number one, they're usually for me, people with a spiritual foundation who are true, not just saying the things that they want to hear mm-hmm. just because they know that's what you want to hear. Right. Mm-hmm. And then time t- tells the difference. Mm-hmm. Time tells everything. Mm-hmm. You know, if you get down, those true people will be the ones that call you, mm-hmm. you know, and, and, and in the entertainment business, the business world, it's all similar. When you're up financially, everybody, their mother, brother, sister, cats and dogs are around you. Mm-hmm. You know, you're when right. times are hard, you know, some Friends of those same cheap. people won't even come to your house if you're having a right. home party because right. they know and they'll say things like, oh, that cat fell off. Well, the good thing about scheduling for success is you can reinvent yourself to always maintain growth. So all that's happened right now is you guys, even with the radio station here, you reinvented something and it's going to get bigger and bigger and bigger. Mm -hmm. All you have to do is keep fighting the battle because you know what? In life and in business, things are going to happen. But keep good people around you by qualifying them. Um. I wanted to ask you also, when you're not writing or touring, whatever, what do you like? Was what, what does Paul D. Jones like to do with his son and your home? What is like rec time? Like just TV movies? Like what do you like to do? You know what? I love movies. Mm-hmm. You know, I can go to a movie theater by myself, get my popcorn, and, my <laughs> drink, and, and I'm at peace mm-hmm. with myself. You know, right. and I actually schedule time for that because in the book Schedule for Success, I actually talk about schedule time for your own spiritual enrichment you right. know uh, right. what's old girl had to song me time you know right, right. so you got to schedule me time but one of my favorite things really to do is i enjoy spending time with my family mm-hmm. you know my daughter i have a 17 year old daughter she's a wonderful young lady mm-hmm. thank god i got a good one you know <laughs> <laughs> like, whoa right, right. thank you lord you know and then i have a six-year-old son who's just he, he's my he's my dude mm-hmm. you know so it's like between them two and my wife and the whole family really sometimes sitting in the house you know you work hard Mm-hmm. You know, but sometimes you could sit in the summertime and just watch the kids out at the pool right. mm-hmm. enjoying right. themselves. Mm-hmm. Man, that's priceless. You know, mm-hmm. for anything else, it may be MasterCard. <laughs> 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 so where can they find Schedule for Success? Well, I always tell them to come directly to the source. So go to pauliejones.com. That's P-A-U-L-Y-J-O-N-E-S.com. Mm-hmm. Pauliejones.com. They can get it. Uh, obviously Barnes and Nobles, Amazon, any place the major books are sold. Right. Mm-hmm. You know, you can get Paulie jo- uh get scheduled for success as well as my first book, Who Told You You Were Broke. Mm-hmm. You know, they can get all of that. As well as uh obviously we're in a technology of the Facebook world. So go to Facebook mm-hmm. forward slash schedule for success. And you know, I like people to reach out to us too so we can uh get the the energy, the vibe and if people ask good questions that even make me go mm-hmm. to research mm-hmm. more. I like that title. Who told you you were broke? Who told you you were broke? <laughs> You got a Twitter or anything? You want to keep up? You talk yeah. to, like, you know. Twitter Twitter is, um, you know, we set it up and you don't lost your passion. Yeah, I can actually reply right. to the person. <laughs> you know, so that that's that. But, yeah, if they, they get me on uh, pauliejones.com or Facebook for right. that schedule for success, I'm, I'm in there. Or they can come through y'all. There you exactly, go. exactly. That's right. NYP Entertainment. Gmail.com. Exactly. <laughs> right. It's fam now. It's fam. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Appreciate it. Thank you. 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 Thank you.
appreciate well, we, you stopping by. Thank you so much. Pleasure's all mine. Yeah, we know that you got a busy schedule today, so yeah, yeah we're we'll definitely grateful that you stopped down. You know, stopped through here and grace us with your your book present, schedule yeah, for success. Exactly. Um, like I said, I, we definitely enjoyed the phone call and to have you here in the studio was wonderful. So thank you so much for coming through. And anytime you want to, let us know. That's Just come right. by and you know chit chat and. Whatever, we don't mind. We really right. appreciate it. Well, anybody, if I'm going to be at uh, Circle of Sisters today, so, okay. uh, come through and uh, holler at me there. I love to shake hands, hug, kiss the babies, do all that. <laughs> you know? So we'll, we'll have Politician. fun with that, too. So. <laughs> yeah, <exactly. laughs> all right, so we're about to go to some music. Ron C., you ready? Ron C. Ron C. Ron C. ready for Ron C. Ron C. I ready? think he's ready. He's getting ready. Ron C. Yeah. getting ready. We're going to go to some music. <laughs> um, we'll come back. we got some more topics and stuff later on. we got Hip Hop Artist F1, and we're going to talk to Ron C., so sit back and relax. He's going to play some music. NYPA Entertainment, Entertainment Radio. Radio.